Hi Virgo, this is your romance reading for October 2020 and welcome back and for those that have landed on this page by accident, welcome and I hope you will subscribe and hit the bell on all. I do go live every week and have a look everybody at the introduction of this week's readings as there's new things happening. If you do click the bell on all you must also set your settings in YouTube and in your device. I've made a video showing how to do it and there's lots of good things happening this autumn so stay with us because there's also free gifts or giveaways so please um, stay informed and now I'm going on to the reading and I hope you will enjoy it and have a look at the transparent review and last week this week and the week before as I have used the transparent tarot in different three different ways I've had beautiful reactions on that so I hope you are just as chuffed about the transparent tarot as I am and the people that have left the reactions I'm also using the tarot of the kingdom and those are the fairy tale cards here and I will be putting these on top of that so you will get an, uh, an in-depth um, reading or definition of the reading. I'm also using TLC for the soul and the answer of the angels. So let's get started with your reading. Well Virgo, we start off with the King of Pentacles. I hope you can see it because I've got it on a pink sheet and uh, it's getting a bit dark here so I hope you can see it. Just put a little bit light on. There you go. Uh, sorry about this. So you've got the King of Pentacles coming in in the first week. This could be a Taurus as he represents Taurus but he could be offering you money, he could be offering you something tangible and that also is has durability and for long term. This could even be a proposal towards you. This, The cards are not discriminating, it is somebody with the status of a king. He's got his emotions under control, he knows what he's investing in. This could also be a woman proposing to a man. But he has the meatiest touch. Everything that he does will turn into gold, will turn out positively. He's steady and he goes into a relationship for the long term. Awesome, beautiful, but don't, um, don't forget it could also be a Virgo or a Capricorn. Then you have the two of fire. Perhaps you two are making plans to get married and he's offering you his hand in marriage. I'll keep it to him because it is the king of pentacles. The two of fire is the two of wands. And look, he is fire and you are green. That could be earth or that, that could also be an earth sign or a water sign. You are planning, making plans for the future. It might cost you some money so you might be um, receiving a gift from somebody to help both of you to form a beautiful partnership because the two of ones means partnerships, forming partnerships, making plans. And your money is coming in big time because you've got the nine of pentacles. You can take it easy now. You don't have to worry with about money or something that is uh, tangible like buying a house. Now you've got money to buy that house or put the extension on. Perhaps that is what you needed a partnership for and somebody gave in this partnership you needed money for extending, perhaps extending the family. There's an ending coming to a phase and there's a new beginning but the finances will be as sound as a pound. You've got the death card number 13 and 13 becomes a 4 which means proper foundations, 
productivity and sound okay something is being built this relationship or partnership will be built on proper and solid foundations the death card means that you're leaving your life from being single and joining up if you are already hooked up then you might be going up to the next phase like I said extending your house because you want to extend the family if you've already got a child perhaps you want to have more children you are ready for this new beginning you're no longer the, but, uh, the, the caterpillar you are the butterfly and you can it's like she's spreading she's spreading her wings look she's spreading her arms and it looks like angel wings so the divine has your back but you might be spreading your wings as you come out the cocoon you are the butterfly and you're flying away to join your partner Ooh, lovely lovely fairy tale you've got the queen of wands she knows what she wants and she goes towards it look she's looking at the chariot she wants to go onwards and upwards she wants to move home perhaps she <coughs> is determined to go on holiday perhaps you haven't had the money to go on holiday this is what could be the plans to f fly fly literally and go on holiday she's a very determined lady she's also creative in what she wants she knows how to get it she's creative about it you've got the four of earth the four of pentacles you've been closed off Virgo perhaps you might have closed off to save money perhaps you have been holding on to your money to get what you want that is what the Queen of Wands would do she has uh, an obsession it can be an obsession and the Queen of Wands is a Leo so perhaps in Leo time and Virgo time you are a Virgo but Pentacles is Virgo um, you as we are in Libra now perhaps you've saved up enough money to go on holiday you are seeing a possibility the four of pentacles means holding on closing uh, yourself off isolating because in the traditional tarot he's got a coin stuck in his head um, one in front of his heart and solar plex and t one on under each foot so you've closed yourself off but now you have found what you want like the queen of wands and you're going to go for it cost what may you might have been saving up for that during august and september uh, beginning september and now you're going to go on holiday in libra time okay or you could be moving home you're opening up well done you can be joyous again because you after all you are the butterfly you're turning into a butterfly you are not dull you are vibrant you are happy as Larry look at that you have uh, in, wrapped your arms around yourself around this tree or this person that's resembling a tree and you're branching out wow and absolutely amazing you are taking the step forward to recognition you've got you've got victory the chariot means you've got victory if you're not hooked up you've got out there you dusted yourself off you held yourself uh, in isolation perhaps you were dreading a, a rejection but you've got recognition and you've got the recognition perhaps from um, a Virgo uh, v Virgo uh, as you've got the king of pentacles but it could be a Taurus you've got the record could have a recognition of a Scorpio because of the death card and you could have a Leo or a cancer perhaps you've been holding on to money from July August September and now you can go on holiday also because the COVID is easing up you've got victory you've got recognition you're going onwards and upwards you might have had that um, uh, what you call it promotion or you finally got a job again and you've been holding on and 
going for what you want, whether it's a job, whether it's a pregnancy, like here holding the baby. Um, no, is she holding the baby? Yeah, they're joining up, and I think she, it was or was it? No, this is two people dancing. Sorry, that was in uh, Leo. People holding a baby. Sorry, but you are uniting. You've got the material good, and you're going for the long term. Okay. So you've got a lot of people: Cancer, Leo, Virgo. Scorpio and you're in your strength okay so you might have got the money now and you're saying to your prospective partner if you're not hooked up or to your partner let's go on holiday let's move home this card also means moving home or going on holiday you could be going on holiday in a car or something with wheels and then you have the tower this came unexpectedly okay something happened and it was unexpectedly you couldn't make a decision you weren't the queen of wands before um, so the divine and the angels gave you an unexpected thunderbolt um, the tower falls so something was not built on proper foundations and perhaps that's why you couldn't move forward you didn't have the determination or perhaps you didn't um, go about it the right way but now everything is turning out for the positive one door is closing and 20 are opening because you've taken the decision what you want you know what you want you've got the money right whatever you do is turning into gold and you've got victory and you're a champion Wow the bo both of you are in the center of a change whether you're hooked up or not and the answer of the angels is listen to your intuition now have you been listening to your intuition with the four of pentacles like I said you've closed yourself off you've opened your heart your solar plex your solar plex is also part of your intuition that's where you get the butterflies in your tummy when you're in love you've opened up your mind to new ideas and you're putting your ideas into action like the queen you're going forward with the chariot now curious rest curious rest whether it's the windiest of days or the quietest of days a little dose of curiosity will go a long way to brighten it up you were curious and you have moved on and you're the champion lean inward inquire within your heart if some insights intuition is that you seem to have suppressed cannot be rekindled right open your heart open your solar plex that is what this little sentence means it's only been safely stored away so that now that you are receptive it can be revealed in light of today's awareness there will be a subtle recognition well big time if you ask me an inkling of intuitive understanding of having been heard even if your mind is still in doubt you've got the tower your question and manifestations have been heard say a quick hello to your wise self that's your higher self and your angels then and have a conversation about life's more receptive happenings do also relinquish that arduous and useless undertaking of trying to fix it or figuring it out just be there in delight okay don't ask why this sudden change came along it was meant to be in the divine time remember time is man made I hope you've enjoyed this uh, reading and I hope you enjoy your relaxing mode because you're going into a beautiful future and face. 
Good on you. I love this reading. It's brilliant. Take care and I hope you like it. Please share and like and stay safe and enjoy the month of October.